it's nearly time to move on from Sparta. But before I leave... I just want to take you on a little um, detour to somewhere that I think is rather magical. It's a medieval ghost town that flourished from the 13th to the 15th centuries. Mistress. The Peloponnese boasts these citadels in the air, like a set from Game of Thrones. Looking out over the stamping ground of Odysseus, Helen, Achilles, and other legends of the Odyssey. Not only does this place feel like the top of the world, there are all kinds of lost worlds here. Over a thousand years after the ancient Spartans, this region was still a key seat of power. Mistras was a vital outpost for the Eastern Roman Empire. After centuries as being the centre of power for all kinds of civilizations, the life slowly started to ebb away from this amazing place and the very last villager left in 1953. You know, I said that um, no one lives here anymore. That's not strictly true, because actually there's a small community of nuns who are still here. Uh, they've been here since the 15th century, and uh, sometimes they, they welcome you in and, um, you know, give you a little something to eat to say hello. I'm going to see if I can find you. How beautiful. Hello, good afternoon. Welcome. Thank you. Hi, I'm Bethany. Ah, and my name is Agnes. Hi, thank you so much. <laughs> it's such a pleasure to be here. Thank you. Look at these. A lot of girls. Can I come in? Yes. <laughs> and the cats too, of course. Yes. Thank you. Very yes. still. Thank you. Agnes. Very still. Look at this. That is so lovely. So Agnes has just said that <laughs> she has this ready. So it's given with love for people when they're on a journey. Honestly, yes. this looks yes. too beautiful. And I'm very hungry. With it. So, yes, so, so, it's, so perfect. Red, red wine. <laughs> well, really, mm. um, red, red wine. To you, to life, to love. To the people. To the people. To the people yeah. and to the love. Because without him, without love, we have nothing. Yes. Absolutely. Mm. Yamas. Mm. Simple things. Delicious. So I'm going on this big journey, this odyssey. What is the one bit of advice you'd give me? To embrace every experience that you have in your life, good ones and bad ones. So are you so wise what you're saying? That's what I think the story of Odysseus mm -hmm. is about, is mm -hmm. how you meet difficulties, you're given challenges, mm -hmm. moral challenges, you have mm -hmm. physical challenges, mm -hmm. but you have to know what's, what matters. Mm -hmm. and, and for him, what matters, despite all the temptations, is mm -hmm. coming home, mm -hmm. is making it home. This is my idea of happiness, Agnes. Mm -hmm. A kitten on my lap, mm -hmm. talking philosophy in a place of extraordinary <laughs> history. And a welcome at the end of a long journey. Little thing. <laughs>